Hi, and welcome to a new video. Do you notice that your iPhone's charging rate is slow and that the battery percentage remains at 80% even hours after being plugged into a charging cable? In this video, I'll go over the different reasons why this happens to your iPhone and how to fix it. Let's go. The most likely reason why your iPhone won't charge past 80% is because of its temperature. The built-in protection on iOS devices keeps your iPhone from overheating. If a warm temperature is detected, your iPhone's charging will automatically slow down or stop. This is due to the fact that charging your battery at a high temperature will harm your iPhone's battery. So if this happens, unplug your iPhone, move to a cooler location, and wait for it to cool down. If you are currently using wireless charging, it is best to return to charging with a cable because charging your iPhone with a cord can reduce heat production. Another reason your iPhone is charging slowly when it reaches 80% is that you have optimized battery charging enabled. On your iPhone, this is enabled by default. The optimized battery charging feature on iOS 13 and later versions are designed to improve battery durability and device lifespan by reducing the amount of time your iPhone spends fully charged. According to Apple, your iPhone uses on-device machine learning to understand your daily charging routine, so that it can wait until you need to use your iPhone to finish charging past 80%. To learn more about this, click the tag or check out the link in the description below. If you need your iPhone to charge quickly and reach 100%, you can temporarily disable optimized battery charging. You can deactivate it until 6 a.m. the next day by selecting Turn Off Until Tomorrow. You can also choose to force restart your iPhone. A force restart can fix minor software issues on your device. To do that with your iPhone 8 or later, quickly press the Volume Up button, then the Volume Down button, then hold down the Side button until the Apple logo appears. If you have an older iPhone, follow the link in the description to know how to force restart your device. Another problem that can cause your iPhone to charge slowly is because of the lightning cable or power adapter that you use. In order to ensure that the accessories you are using are not causing the slow charging of your device, follow along this checklist. First, make sure that your charging port is free from debris. To test, insert a toothpick or another small piece of non-metal material into your charging port to collect any dirt or debris. Next, inspect your lightning cable and charging accessories for signs of wear and tear. It is critical that you do not use any damaged iPhone accessories because if you do, it is possible that your iPhone will not charge at all. Then, check if the accessories you are using are MFI certified and it's best to use a USB-C to lightning cable for its maximum charging speed. If you are looking for an MFI certified lightning cable, check out the tag. Lastly, I recommend using a power adapter with at least 20 watts because it will charge your iPhone faster. You need to also check your iPhone's battery if it still won't charge above 80%. The battery of your iPhone can be worn out over time because of excessive usage. When this happens, your battery needs to be replaced. I recommend that you get your battery replaced at an Apple store. It is not that expensive and only Apple can provide you with an original replacement that will last for a long time. It would be ideal if you had a warranty because the replacement would be free. If you're not sure whether your iPhone's battery needs to be replaced, check its battery health. If the battery health of your iPhone is below 80%, I recommend replacing it. And that's it. If I could help you, feel free to give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Leave a comment down below if you have any questions. See you next time. Bye.